how to crochet the diamond mesh stitch. For this tutorial, you will need a crochet hook and a ball of yarn. Special thanks to our sponsor, Knit Out of the Box, for providing today's yarn. Today we are using their 100% fair trade hand spun Afghani cashmere in the color dark brown. For this stitch you'll need to know the following techniques. Chain stitch, single crochet. To begin this stitch you must create a foundation chain in multiples of 4 plus 3. Row 1. We're going to begin by Skipping the first stitch and doing a single crochet into the second stitch from our hook. Then we're going to start our repeat by chaining five. One, two, three, four, and five. Then we're going to skip the next three stitches. So we've got one, two, three. And then we'll do a single crochet into the fourth stitch. So we've got one, two, three. Here we go, four, and we're going to repeat this sequence all the way across to the end of the row. Then we'll turn our work. Row two. After we've turned our work, we're going to begin by chaining five, and this will start our repeat. Then we're going to do a single crochet into the next five chain space. So that's this big space here. We're just going to go right into the middle and do a single crochet. And we're going to repeat this sequence until we reach the end of the row. Then when we reach the end of our row, we're going to do a single crochet. Instead of doing it into the middle of the chain space, we're going to go right into the turn chain from the row before and then we'll turn our work. Row 3. We're going to begin our repeat by chaining 5. Then we're going to do a single crochet into the next chain space right in the middle there. If you wanted to, you could also do a single crochet into the center chain, which would be the third chain of the 5 chain space, uh, but it's a little bit more tedious. And then we're just going to repeat this sequence until we reach the end of the row. So we won't be doing the single crochet into the turn chain. We're just going to be doing this into the center of the chain space all the way across. And then we will turn our work. So we're going to repeat row three only until you've reached your desired length. And that's how you crochet the diamond mesh stitch. Want more New Stitch Today? Check out our website at newstitchaday.com.